What's up everybody? This is Parker from the Fast Foodies and I'm back with the second cereal inspired protein bar review. A few days ago, I was driving home from the gym when I decided to stop at my local 7-Eleven when I found two cereal inspired protein bars. The first one was a cinnamon toast crunch flavored protein bar. And it was it was okay, but honestly, the, the, there was too strong of a whey protein aftertaste. I like my uh, my VPN field bars much more, which hashtag sponsored plug alert. You can actually use discount code Parker at checkout to save some money. But the second flavored or the second cereal inspired flavor that I found at my local 7-Eleven was Golden Grams. Now, how many other food review YouTubers out there do you see that review cereal inspired protein bars? Probably not many. So definitely make sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on more unique protein bar, cereal, fast food reviews. But I think it's about time to find out if this Golden Grams cereal inspired protein bar tastes any better than the Cinnamon Toast Crunch. That's what it looks like. It smells like Golden Grams, but then again, the Cinnamon Toast Crunch one smells like Cinnamon Toast Crunch. And we all know where that ended up. It is as I feared. Once again, the initial the initial flavor, it's nice. It tastes like a legit golden grams, has that, that honey flavor, slight cinnamon. But the more you eat it, the longer you eat it for. Yeah, I don't know. I have the same issue with the other the other review I did. I don't know how to describe that kind of way that whey flavor, whatever it is, it comes as you eat it for longer and longer. And it really does mask that initial delicious flavor you get. So for ratings, um, I'm gonna give this the same rating that I gave to the Cinnamon Toast Crunch one, five and a half out of 10. There you guys go. Hope you enjoyed this review of this Golden Grams protein bar. This really did have potential. Both of these bars, this one and the Cinnamon Toast Crunch one, both had potential, but unfortunately, General Mills. If you made it to the end of this video, then I'm sure that you want to become a fast foodie as well. So all you have to do is hit that subscribe button. And to see exclusive behind the scenes footage, then you can head on over to Instagram and follow the Fast Foodies at Fast Foodies Review.